Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Ladles and Lilies. Today, we are gonna take a look inside of Victus Study Skills. So let's take a look inside. This is a system, this is kinda, or can be taught like in a classroom, so, um, but you can do it one-on-one. -on -one. When we start off our school next year, this is what we will be starting with and also um, an executive functioning skills workbook that we will be doing next year before we even start any of our schoolwork for the school year. Also, there are some slides that come along with this when you order this. I ordered it through Rainbow Resources and basically they will send you an email with all of the things. There's also a quiz um, that they send to you I don't remember whether it was the same email or a separate email. And in order to get the slides, you have to go through IEW on their website. They will let you make an account and download the slides that you need to do this if you want to have a visual element for your kids. All right, so let's hop right inside. We're going to go into the teacher's edition of this. So you have the introduction where it talks about the philosophy um, behind this section one teachers instructions section two you have all your lessons and then three appendix um, as you can see there are about nine lessons in here in the instructions it shows you how to organize it talks about the methods materials and all those good things so let's look it says Victus study skills system is a way of life Basically, this is not just something that you're going to do one time with your kids, but you are always going to um, review this with your kids so they can get better at doing it, right? Right. It says, number one, zeal without knowledge is not good, but zeal with knowledge bears fruit. And then it says, number two says, results come from the process. Number three says, any system with all of its components must have an aim or purpose. Number four says an effective system of study has the greatest likelihood of aiding in success. So it is just kind of giving you um, an introduction on how they feel about it. Where are you now? Where do you want to be? And how do you get there? Basically, this system is helping you to answer these three questions. Um, they give you the objectives. So. It gives you concepts necessary for student success and progress and effective study throughout life. So this is not just for homeschool. This is to take them through life. And as you remind them and review it and go through it with them at different times in the homeschool year or just remind them to do it, um, this will help them throughout life. So I really like that about that. Um, it's designed to accomplish the following objectives. Understand that there are specific steps and strategies. It builds skills and tools. It develops attitudes and it helps them understand more fully their own role in their, their success. Do we like that? Yes, their success. <laughs> Sorry about all the shadows, but yeah, I'm using an up-close light. Um... Method is saying once your kids understand what they are doing, it will work better for them. Materials that they have in their student text allows for hands-on participation. And it's very good because they get used to doing it and practicing themselves and working on it over and over until it works for them. Um, how can you best use your teacher edition? Um, understanding the philosophy, um, go through the techniques. Um, I will say from me already reading through this, that this is kind of hefty. So if you do do this, I would say read it through more than once because it was a lot when I was reading it, even though when you see what kind of skills they are, you're kind of like, oh, okay, we already you know, some of the skills is like, we've done that already. But um, yeah, through the teacher's manual, you need some, um, you need to read it over. Um, effective techniques, sample course plan. This is what you could do in five days. There's only nine lessons. So it does lay it out so that you could do, there's sorry, there's 10 lessons. Lesson 10 is a review. So 
Um, you can do this whole course in one week, which is why I chose to do this for our first week of school. Um, and then the fundamental things. I told you these earlier. Where am I now? Where do I want to be? How do I get there? So this is basically they're setting you on a course. And then this gets more into the lessons. Um, I'm going to show you the lessons from inside the student book, but I will show you. It gives you examples and it fills in um, answers that they might need to have in the teacher's manual. So, yeah, this is all in the teacher's manual. And then in the back of the teacher's manual, there are also extra um, sheets that you could, you know, you can copy this one or this is showing you what the teacher, what, what the teacher, this is showing you what the student is saying. So, yes. So that's the teacher's edition. So let's get into the lessons um, that don't pay attention to my, um, <laughs> my calendar, which I will be showing you once because I plan to go do more planning on my channel. So let's look into the student um, edition. And again, it goes over with them. What is the aim of the course, which I already told you about, you know, what are your objectives and the three questions that they are going to answer along the way um, to figure out how they will do their best work when it comes to their work. It goes over their how do they learn and then it gives you learning your learning strengths as homeschool moms i know we sometimes are always trying to um, incorporate more of their learning style into their curriculum but as they get older i feel like yes you should know how you learn you should really know like whether you need to take out flashcards or you need to have something um you like notebooks you like to take notes however you like to um study so then it goes into what's their story it talks about some people and then it says creating your mission statement, deciding goals and priorities. I'm not going to show all of the book, but I do want to show some pages because and then it goes over smart. Everybody knows smart when it comes to making goals, specific, measurable, achievable, realistic and time bound. Um, then you get sheets to fill out. I like these because you're going to get a bunch of these for the year for them to fill out. They can fill it out on their own. And then it goes into making a schedule. Um, this is something I feel like as high schoolers, this will really help them. Um, my going into fifth grade, I did not get a student book for him because I figured he is still kind of dependent on me as far as his work is concerned. And then it goes into talking about task and organization. It also goes into your study environment. It goes into something called PQRST, which I'm not going to put everything out here, like I said, because I know when <laughs> people are like, Dag, you showed my whole book on YouTube. But anyway, no, it goes through, gives them a lot of questions and uh, makes them answer a lot and just giving them, you know, just giving older kids great information to make better habits as they get older in life. And as you know, well, especially us women out here in the streets at our homemakers, uh, having good organization skills, it really helps in the home. So <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so this is just what it looks like. It keeps going. It talks about multiple choice tests, goal setting. Um, yes, your hours in the day. What does that look like? It really goes into breaking it down and showing them like, because sometimes, you know, our kids really think that, they have more time than they really do. And sometimes we think that as mothers as well. So um, there's also a grade log to show them if that's something that you wanted to incorporate in your homeschool, where you let them um, keep their own grades. Hey, why not? More power to you, right? Make them as independent <laughs> as possible, right? I will show you one last time the student notebook and kind of hold it up to you. But this is basically the front page so you can really see everything that is inside this book that you're going to do guys thanks for hanging around with me here at ladles and lilies i have more for you coming so if you don't want to miss subscribe to this channel and i will check you out in my next video
Bye.